That was a little big, right? What? My my thing. Fuck. Well, it's good that the hood is big. But it's I got this jacket for Japan, and it was only like what forty dollars? Yeah. Fifty dollars. It was on sale. I knew I needed a thicker jacket because it's like what snowing in Japan? Well, it's pretty cold. I do have winter coats. I don't know if they fit me anymore. Only like 14 of them. But I didn't want to like look for them. I don't think they fit. I'm a lot bigger now. <laughs> but like look at my, my, look at this hoodie. Okay. Now ready? Are you guys ready? This is how big it is. Hey. I can't see. But I'm warm. Hi to everyone. So yeah. It's but you though. know what? When it's cold and windy, you'll really appreciate that hood. Yeah. I wasn't sure like on the size of this, but. My love here was like, just get it a size bigger. Yeah. And I'm like, and I like my jackets fitted really tight just because it looks more, um, I don't know. I just like it when it like kind of is a little bit more fitting. But he's like, get it a size bigger so you want to be comfortable, you know, in case you wear sweaters and you can zip well, it up. Well, you, you will be wearing a sweater. Yeah. You know, it's going to be cold. You're going to be wearing a sweater. So if you get it your actual size, when you put it on, make the arms feel really tight. And, and I'm It's not going to be comfortable. It's what I'm always uncomfortable about and complain about. So this, I took his advice and I got it a size bigger. And for a second there, I was like, fucking A, why did I listen to him? It's funny. I, ha I honestly thought it'd be more like Sherpa, but it's like a Muppet. Yeah. I felt I feel like I killed a Muppet. <laughs> Is there a black Muppet? No. If there was one, he's dead now. Well, I'm wearing him. Yeah. So yeah. So what are we doing right now? Oh, Jesse shot earlier today. Yeah. And then they're doing, um, Planet Blue's having like this whole like, let's all go spinning with each other. Or something like that, right? Yes. But, so they're going to Soul, Soul Cycle. Which would be my first time going in LA. Yeah. Um, the, the place that we normally go to is called Yats. Yes. So it's called it's yoga and spinning. We only ever did the spinning part. The spinning part. part. Yeah. Um, but Jesse's going to go to Soul Cycle because they're having, like, what are they doing? Like, what's the deal with it? Is it just because. It's just for fun. I think just like team building kind of like stuff. And like so a does free... that mean you're technically like really an employee, but you're not an employee? No, I just get invited. That's nice. Yeah. It's very nice of them. So, I mean, basically, it's just like a, you know, it's like a fun thing, a fun benefit of working with them. That's cool. Yeah. Let's see this vlogging situation. Let's see if it really, if I really do it or not. Look at him in his spinning outfit. Do you have your shoes? Dude, your, your legs are so white. Shh. What are we? That's Jeep? racial profiling. Now you're, now you're so red. The devil, the devil. Yeah. What's 800 degrees? Pizza. Is it a, oh. Yeah. So that'd be awesome if you like got it when spinning and then got pizza after. I'm totally down to do that. Oh, there's still cycle. Okay. Okay. Bye. Okay. Bye. So that way into the right. Okay. Bye. I'll see you in a bit. Okay. I love you. Love you too. Bye. Uh, Sephora, me by myself, is not a good thing. Yes, it's not. This is weird, vlogging by yourself. Okay, bye. Okay, so we're back. I'm really bad at vlogging. It's really weird. Like vlogging, like Jesse's like my security blanket when we're vlogging. Even then, like I always feel kind of weird vlogging. Like when there's a group of people, I always have them like drop the camera down. I don't know. He's so good at it. I'm not. But yeah, I just wanted to say hello to Hannah and a couple of you girls. A couple of you girls at Urban Outfitters that said hello. <laughs> hello. I hope I didn't scare you guys because I was a little bit like, whoa, hey, what's up? Um, so yeah, just wanted to say hello and thank you for saying hello to me. Um, Jesse's over here dying. He doesn't want me to shoot him just yet. He needs to like, what is it? Gain his composure. Are you ready? You want to see yourself? Wow. You're fine. You should work out. Yeah. So now I'm going to eat tacos and burritos. 
so funny. I'm like, you right get right soup. Right. Yeah, I'm gonna get soup. Yeah. Cold soup. Yeah. <laughs> what? It's a cold soup. Oh, okay. Wow, guys, if you've never done Soul Cycle before, I'm gonna turn this way. If you've never done Soul Cycle before, it's something different. I don't know if it's anywhere other than LA, but it's in New York. Yeah. yeah. Wow. It's a little intense. Let's What's go the difference between yeah. Would you say it's ma majorly different? It's like a nightclub. Oh. It's like a nightclub. It's completely in the dark, so you can't see anything. You can't see where your water is. You can't see where your towel is. You can't see where the dials are. It's scary, actually. Yeah. How do you know when to go? Exactly. Like for me, and I didn't see the dials. They like they oh, pretty no, much really? like. Yeah, it's pretty dark. At no. Night, we've done it at night. It's literally darker than that. Really? And they have they have lights on faders, oh, it is and the guy like flicks the light up and down, and he yells. And he dances, he throws his towel up in the air, and he's doing and a Britney Spears move. So he's, um, he's Cuban. Very, very Cuban. Uh, so, crazy. Okay, but like what we do, yeah, is at least we get to, like, the instructor has a different type of music, right? Like, we pick our instructor depending on what music you're This was like intense club, like, dubstep, like, as loud as possible. EDM? Yeah. Like maybe no, can you like, do you think like you should be spinning and doing ecstasy? I think the guy did like just took a giant handful of coke and shoved it into his face right before the class and then taught the class. Uh, That's how like intense it was. Yeah, it was insane. Yeah, I know, right? Oh my god. Oh. No! I'm trying not to throw up right now, guys. I said I'm trying not to throw up right now. Focus on me. <sighs> okay. I haven't bought anything from American Apparel. It's been a long time. Not really. I do need chonies, awesome. yeah. No, not right now. I just want to like sit down and die. Are your legs like wobbly? <laughs> My legs are super wobbly I'm right so now. Sorry. I'm like a baby deer right now. You want me to drive? I'm also super cold, like freezing cold. Because of the sweat. Because oh. I'm all, yeah, and I have like bare sure legs. legs. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> the brightest legs ever. Yeah, it is. <laughs> well, I'm gonna like step into traffic and like cars are gonna start crashing. <laughs> I love you. <laughs> Get ready again. Oh, okay. We'll catch up with you guys in a minute. Where? Good morning, guys. It's Saturday morning. Very early. Let me see. It is 8.25 a.m. It is a pretty nice day. A little bit cloudy, but definitely not as bad as the East Coast. If you guys are on the East Coast and you're dealing with that snowstorm, Good luck everybody. I know how it feels. We used to live in Ottawa and we used to get shit like that all the time. So be careful. Don't go anywhere. Stay home. Although by the time you see this, it'll probably all be done. You'll be like, oh, it wasn't that bad. Uh, so I am just going to head into Gelson's um, to get some uh, groceries. And yeah, it's going to be about my day. We're going to clean up. And uh, we have a delivery coming, and I will show you that later today when it gets in. Pretty excited about it. Psst. Psst. I have a friend because I'm eating a sandwich right now. I'm just waiting for our delivery. I'll give you a hint, guys. It's gonna go right there. There. Not there. Right there. Uh, yeah, so here's my sandwich. It's Pretty delicious. It is uh, a little brioche bun with peppered salami, uh, Swiss cheese, and Italian spicy spread. And I have some olives that I'm gonna eat too. So yeah, I'm just waiting for the delivery to get here. Hopefully, hopefully it comes in pretty soon. I don't, oh, what do I hear? What do I hear? Uh, 
not even close. Still waiting on my delivery. They're getting really close to their their window of time that they have left to be able to do it. Okay, they have half an hour to get here. So I've just been cleaning up. I've got my little buddy over here. Uh, I find that if you put him up somewhere high, he doesn't follow you around. So it's actually really good. And he just goes to sleep. So, uh, so I'm just doing some laundry, cleaning up everything. Uh, now I'm making some coffee. So uh, back to the Chemex. I've got some stump town in there. So I'm thinking of actually doing a little coffee making video. Let me know what you guys think if you think that's something you'd be interested in. How to make fancy coffee. Um, I really don't know how. Well, I guess I've been learning, but there's certain things I'm willing to take time on and certain things I'm really not willing to take time on. Like, I, I just don't have the time in my life to properly measure out the amount of grinds. I just kind of like shake the bag. I don't know. Uh, it always tastes good, so. I've previously been using um, groundwork coffee, but I just picked up uh, some Stumptown um, when I was at Whole Foods, and uh, it's actually really good. But I found out that I was using the coffee, well, I guess it's espresso beans. <laughs> so I'm like, this coffee is nice and strong. Uh, dipshit Jesse, you're using espresso beans. Uh, but it still tastes really good, so I'm, I'm quite happy with it. Uh, so yeah, just waiting for the delivery guys. Uh, Anna's working till 5 and I think we're doing something after that. So, I mean, come on. Come on guys, I hate delivery windows. At least this was only a two hour window. Usually they're like between 8 and 5, you know? I don't know. So, we'll catch up with you guys hopefully within the next half an hour. And we'll have something awesome over there. Color me unimpressed. Color also, you red. Color me red. There, this is the correct face Why? for me, Riddle. Because we didn't get what our dining room table. Oh. Also, I just ruined the surprise, guys. What? We were getting a dining room table. I was like, we're getting something right here. Just it was kidding. super obvious, but maybe you didn't know what it was. Maybe they thought it was a rug. I don't know. Anyways. West Elm, you didn't deliver our table and you made me stay home all day when I could have been doing like super productive things or like saving the world or doing stuff like that. But instead, I sat around and did nothing. Sorry. Well, I cleaned, but whatever. You did something. Uh, so me and this sexy little lady right here are going out to dinner because she's looking fine. Silly. Fine. So, uh, so we are headed back to a place called The Church Key. Yes which is super good and we've only been once. I've been twice. Twice. But no, it was once. for like for brunch. it was for brunch. Didn't really count, it wasn't Wait, like so I'm oh we have only eaten once. You've only eaten there once, yeah. Wait, we're, oh with your parents, right? Yes, and my cousin. So it's gonna be very nice to have dinner there again because it was like mwah, delicious. Uh but yeah, so we'll catch up with you guys when we get there. You have anything to add? No. Okay, good. Bye! Bye. 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 We're doing that annoying thing that couples do when they sit together. That annoying thing that couples do when they sit together. Well, we have a couch. It's kind of awesome in here. Any restaurant with a couch? Oh, good.